First at six, though, the violent attack caught on camera at a car wash. Uh, this way have been fueled by a lover's triangle, and how it all played out is really, really hard to believe. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaykat is in Chesterfield Township tonight with the video you'll see only on 7. Prosecutors say the compelling evidence captured on video shows a very ugly fight scene taking place at this car wash that followed a victim being struck with a minivan. Take a close look at the silver-colored minivan at the top left of your screen. The driver, who's been parked across the street from the auto car wash on Jefferson in Chesterfield Township, suddenly hits the gas, crossing the road, slamming into a worker who just stepped outside. Prosecutors say 25-year-old Roy Kowalski had been planning this for some time. Apparently there's a history between the two of them involving a woman. On that November 3rd afternoon, right here off the beaten path, video showing things were far from over. He takes off out of the parking lot, and next thing you know, he comes walking back into, into the frame. Prosecutor Eric Smith says the driver was back for round two. Only the victim, who was just knocked down, was back up now carrying a shovel in self-defense. The two then getting into a nasty brawl, complete with punching, kicking, and swinging of that shovel. It's a terrible idea to go and hit the guy with your car, because then we charge these ser very serious charges. Secondly, it's even a worse idea to come back, because when he comes back... He gets in a very lengthy fight with our victim. Smith says Kowalski faces charges of felony assault with intent to murder and assault and battery, and that he committed those crimes after learning his ex-girlfriend had started seeing the victim with whom she worked at the car wash. For now, Kowalski's out on bond awaiting trial. All in all, Smith says the victim had every right to defend himself. Clearly, he is defending himself. He, he didn't chase, our victim didn't chase this guy down the road. The victim and defendant were both treated for non-life-threatening injuries. Prosecutors say that video we showed you will be a central part of this case moving forward. From Chesterfield Township, Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. Wow,